hey aquarius welcome to my channel so today we're going to be doing y'all general love reading all right um if you want to book a personal reading with me i am only accepting payments through paypal you guys because unfortunately there is something going on with my cash app but for now we're going i'm only going to be using paypal okay so if you are interested into booking a personal or you're thinking about it you can paypal me at jlovestarot at gmail.com that is also my email okay y'all you can look in the description box down below for more details more information about it okay but i'm only accepting payments through paypal so if you're interested paypal your girl okay and yeah we're finally gonna be getting into may you guys we're finally entering a new month okay and I'm super excited for it. And today we're going to be looking into your persons to see what's their energy, what's their vibe. Okay, and then we're going to be looking into what's their energy, what's their vibe towards them. Okay, y'all. So let's see. Let me show you. Spirit, how does this person currently feel about my Aquarius for May 2021? How does this person feel about my Aquarius? Aquarians. How does this person currently feel about my Aquarius for May 2021? Ooh. How does this person feel about my Aquarius spirit for May 2021? Okay, y'all. So, oh, we have the Six of Cups, the Lovers, the Empress, the Seven of Swords. Okay. Spirit, how does this person feel about my Aquarius? The Queen of Swords, Knight of Swords, Two of Pentacles, and the Nine of Cups. Okay, um, so y'all, the energy that I'm getting today, first of all, you could be dealing with a Gemini, a Libra, or uh, a water sign, a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Okay, so I feel like this could be somebody from your past who you're dealing with with the Six of Cups. Okay, but I feel like this person is thinking about you a lot. They're thinking about you. They're missing you here. Okay. And I'm hearing pregnancy. Something about pregnancy. They want to be in a relationship with you, Aquarius, okay? And I feel like the Empress talks about pregnancy, so I do believe this person could be thinking about pregnancy with you, you know, you being a mom, my feminines, okay? But if not, then this person is highly attracted to you. They, they view you as somebody who's very alluring, very gorgeous, very beautiful, okay, whether you're male or female, Okay? We have the Seven of Swords. Ooh. So this person could have been very manipulative. Okay, this person, they could have cheated. They could have been very... They couldn't... They could have been very... They told a lot of lies. They weren't being very truthful towards you. Okay, maybe this person cheated. They done something behind your back here. Okay. I'm hearing that... Somebody here cheated on the other person. Somebody here. Okay, y'all. This is not gonna this is not gonna go for everybody. But what spirit is telling me is that somebody here cheated on. Okay, how can I say this? Somebody 
I'm getting a masculine. A masculine cheated on somebody. While somebody, you, Aquarius, was pregnant. I don't know why I'm thinking about this. But Spirit is telling me that you guys were in a relationship. But this person cheated on you while you while you were pregnant. Okay, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that if that's really the story, y'all. That's that's not gonna go for everybody, but somebody it could resonate with. But I feel like somebody here got cheated on. Okay, but if that's not the case, then I feel like this person wants to be in a relationship with you. This past person is thinking about you a lot. Okay, it could be in with a Gemini. This person wants to be in a relationship. They want to be in a commitment with you. Because they find you very beautiful, very attractive. Okay? Mm -hmm. The Queen of Swords. You could be in with the Libra. This person feels like you may come off as cold. Like, they, they feel like you are. if they were to come forward, you're going to cut them off. And it's like, you're not playing with their games. Like, come in, but don't play any games with me. Okay? Um, like, that's how they feel your energy is. Like, maybe because this person has done wrong in the past. And it's like... You don't trust them. So it's like they know your energy. Like they feel your energy. And it's like that's really how you're going to be, the um, Aquarius. Like you're really you're really going to be like, okay, you could come forward. But like I don't trust you. Okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm getting a lot out of this story. The Knight of Swords. You want... You feel this person is going to come forward or you want this person to come forward or this person could have been in and out. Okay, this person could have been in and out of the relationship, the connection here. And it was very toxic. The two of pentacles, this person's been juggling. Okay, I do believe this person could have been juggling another person. Juggling you with another person. Like, that's the energy that I'm getting here, y'all. Like... <laughs> But it's like they want to come forward or they feel. This person knows that you don't trust them. Aquarius. They know you don't trust them. Because they, they've done wrong. But now it's like they're willing to change. Okay, we have the nine of cups. This person views it as their happiness. Now it's like. You make this person happy. And they're realizing that they should have never cheated or become very toxic towards you. Okay, because now it's like they're having an epiphany and a realization that you're their happiness. But I do believe this person is juggling something. Okay? And it's like they're thinking about coming forward, but they know that you... You are not gonna accept them, or you're not, you don't trust them still because they've been very manipulative and very toxic. Okay, but they love you, Aquarius. This person loves you very, very much. They're thinking about wanting to be in a relationship, they're thinking about wanting to be in a connection with you. Okay, this could be a past person, but they're thinking about you very much. They're thinking about you a lot. Okay, y'all. Oh my god, this, this reading was very intense today, y'all. <laughs> Now, it's not going to go for everybody. Like I said, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. But I do believe that it will resonate with somebody out there. Okay. All right. So let's see how you feel about them. Let me show you. Spirit, how does my Aquarius feel about this person? What can you tell me? How does my Aquarius currently feel about this person, Spirit? The Emperor. Could be dealing with the Aries. Okay, so you feel like this person could have been very controlling? Like this person was very controlling towards you. Or you want to control them or this connection. The Three of Swords. Yeah, there was a lot of pain. This person caused... Hold on, y'all. This person... I feel like there was a situation here. This person was very toxic. It's whether they cheated 
they broke up with you, they, you know, accused you for something or, you know, made you very upset here, Aquarius. And I feel like you were very upset about that, that this person was doing this to you. There is a lot of pain here coming from them. Yeah, the Nine of Swords. This person caused a lot, caused you to have a lot of sleepless nights, a lot of pain. Okay, because this person, they've done very wrong towards you, Aquarius. Okay. Square, how does my Aquarius, how does my Aquarius feel about this person? It's like you're not really happy about what they've done, with what they're doing to you or what they've done to you. Okay, yeah, there was an ending here. Okay, could have been with a Scorpio or an Aries. But it's like, ugh, you wished that this didn't happen or you didn't expect this to happen with this person. Something you didn't expect with them is what I'm getting. Spirit, how did my Aquarius feel about this person? The Four of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands, yeah. I feel like you're still very guarded towards them, y'all. You guys are very much having your wall up, okay, protecting your energy, protecting yourself, because you don't want your feelings to get hurt. Like, that's the energy that I'm getting. Because this person, you know, has caused a lot of pain in this connection, now it's like you have to stand up for yourself and you're protecting yourself and your energy because you don't want to get hurt from, from this person again. Okay, like that's the energy that I'm getting. What Spirit is trying to tell me. Spirit, how does my Aquarius feel about this person? Thank you. The Four of Swords. Yeah, I feel like you're taking a break from them. Like you're not, you could be very like working, focusing on yourself or healing. I feel like you guys are healing from this connection because, because it was so toxic and it caused you to have a lot of pain, a lot of, you know, maybe you cried a little bit. You know, you weren't happy. And now it's like you're trying to heal. You're trying to make all this pain go away. Or this could be their energy. How you feel about them. Maybe they're healing or you want them to heal. So that they can fix their ways. Spirit, how does my query? Thank you. The Eight of Pentacles. You want to work, you want this connection to be able to come together. Wow, y'all, the Two of Cups came out in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like this connection, like there was a separation here. Okay. Spirit, how does my Aquarius feel about this person? Like, you do have some fears that, you know, like this connection may never come back together or you guys are not going to get together. The hangman, yeah, you're feeling stuck. It's like you don't know if this is gonna work out because this person caused you a lot. Aquarius. Yeah, the tower moment. Wow. This person has caused a lot of conflict in this connection, is what I'm feeling like, y'all. And this person. They hurt you. They hurt. They cause you a lot of pain, a lot of sleepless nights. And now it's like you have to protect yourself. You're feeling like I have to protect my energy. I have to protect myself because I don't want to keep on having to feel this way. You know, I don't want to have to keep on, you know, looking like a fool and, you know, getting cheated on and getting lied on because, you know, my feelings and my energy comes first. And I don't want to keep on feeling this way towards you know, myself and this person. Okay? Like, that's the energy that I'm getting here, y'all. Alright, so that's going to be it for today's reading, you guys. Um, I'm wishing y'all all the best. Okay? Um, like I said before, if you want to book a personal reading with me, you know, feel free to do that. You can PayPal me at jlovesterra.gmail.com. More information is in my description box down below. Alright, um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. 
and thank you so much for all of your support and appreciation okay i love you guys and see you soon bye